Howdy friends, I'm Joe. For those of you that don't know, it's oil change day. I'm gonna change oil on the wife's in my truck. So, come along. Let's uh, see how this goes. Let's go! I make living hard look too easy. So while we wait for that to drain, usually what I'll do on this car is just kind of walk around. There's, there's no oil zerts. It's pretty. Uh, it's a 2014 GMC terrain uh, with a 2.4 liter. So and then there's like all the ball joints are just sealed. There's nothing. I guess I'll just look for nails in the tire or something. That one's good. Check the bearings. So that water's no good. That water. <coughs> Hi. No, the the water's car's good, way but up I didn't there. Have like anything to put the water in. Isn't that car way up there? Mommy's car is up high. She went poo poo. This the filter is right there. The paper filter. Hey, let's turn it around. Come on up. Ow. You fix the car. Do it. Okay. And then more cars. And I'm happy to have her like that. Did you check the air filter? Oh, yeah. What about the blanket for the bed? Yeah. Is it coming out tomorrow or her? Her accessory for solar. Or percent or something like that. We got it. So. Sounds like a pretty good deal. They're putting it on the front and they're going, well, the only thing is this tree here is kind of going to maybe get you at 80%, 85%. You thought about doing like along the fence? Or? No, the front of the house. On the roof? I go, the tree's gone. The duck. <laughs> no, uh -oh. they'll be, so I'll be knocking uh -oh. down for like 100 and uh. Yeah! Oh my. Right. Okay, now we gotta put it back in. Okay, it goes in right there. Sorry, I pulled it out because I figured that the uh -uh. There it is. We put it back on. 
Yours and I dropped the whole cord in it. Again. I'll and done. it up to like halfway Again. in there. So, she might have a hole on her. No, it's just uh, that that motor is going to oil. Great work! Well, sure. Okay, now we gotta put the oil back in. So we pull it in, I change it. There we go, Miss Olivia. All done. Yeah. But this that dodge, I think I got it to where it's gonna go three hundred dollars Okay, now I gotta put the cat back on. Click. Are you helping mommy wash the car? You got soap in your hair. Truck's got plenty of greasies. I think it's done dripping. Love you.
So since we got two of these trucks that we changed oil on, we went and got one of these uh, filter socket thingies. Seems to work out pretty well. Just put a 3 8 ratchet on there. So one thing that we do since we have the luxury of changing our own oil is put a little oil on the gasket, which it should always do. Just ensures a good seal. Then I'll take just a couple out of one of the quarts or gallons that I'll be using. I'll just put a little bit in the filter just enough to get some oil in there so when it starts it's not completely dry and then the, it's working to fill it up now it's got a little bit something to start with let's uh, slap it back on Oh, that would have been bad. Don't forget to put your freshly greased fil oiled filter on, or O-ring. Just hand tight. <clears throat> Got two more little grease certs to do while it's at this height. So my tripod decided to take a dump on me. So we'll just set you on top of the engine. There it is. And that's what goes into taking care of uh, the wife and mine vehicles. Um, maintenance is key. If we take care of them now, we won't have to deal with any issues down the road, hopefully. So I think it's time she gets a wash.